After writing a research paper or a review article, one of the major challenges is finding a suitable journal for publishing. While searching, you come across two major types of journals, the open access journals and the subscription based journals. But which type of journals should you choose? In today's video, you will learn everything about open access and subscription based journals. What are the major differences between them? Which journal category you should choose while considering the benefits and drawbacks of each of these. I will also talk about my choice of publishing. So do not skip this video and watch till the end. The open access journals are the journals that charges money in the form of article processing charges or APCs from the authors for publishing the article. And readers can access it anytime without paying any money or subscription charges. Due to this reason, the papers published in open access journals are often read more and thus has higher probability of getting cited. So if the authors have sufficient funds and are willing to spend several hundred dollars for publishing and also are more concerned about their citations of the paper, it is recommended to publish in open access journals. Also you may request for discounts or fee waiver before uploading your manuscript to get it published in open access mode. On the other hand, if authors have limited research fund or if they are unwilling to spend money on publishing, they may choose subscription based journals. Subscription journals do not charge money from authors, rather these journal charges from the readers or the institutions for providing access to read and download the papers. The major drawback of this mode is that certain readers or institutions may not have subscription or are unwilling to pay subscription fee. This might affect the number of readers and thus the citations. A third category of journals are hybrid journals. In these journals, you can publish either in open access mode or in subscription mode. I recently got my review published in Environmental and Experimental Botany, which is a hybrid journal of Elsevier. I did not want to spend money for publishing, therefore opted to publish it in subscription mode. The journal has provided me a link to share the complete article for free for first 50 days. Whether it is an open access journal or subscription based, it does not really affect the chances of acceptance of the paper, provided that the journal is peer reviewed, indexed and reputable. Stay away from predatory journals which publishes your paper without getting it reviewed just by paying some money for it. I hope this video will help you choose the right journal category for you. You can also check out my video on how to choose a suitable journal for publishing in which I have mentioned based on the research topic how to find a right journal. Check out my playlist on research and publishing for more such useful content. Thanks for staying connected and see you in my next video.